you're late. Listen, I'm well aware that there are already 4 videos of various Tickmen talking about the levels of highness. But, I've done a bit of research and it turns out that number 5 is <clears throat> associated with the universe and also divine will. So it's not me who's decided to shamelessly appropriate the format. It was God's will, I didn't have a choice. Fucking liar. Also, I'd like to mention that I've never smoked weed as I am aggressively straight, so nothing even remotely phallus shaped has ever been near and or inside my mouth. Fucking liar. But I have ingested it in the form of edibles more times than I'm willing to admit. Having said that, thanks to Mostly True for being a big inspiration for the video, as well as others. On to the levels. Level 1 Lift off. Level 1 of an edible high is very much akin to a level 4 of a smoking high. You're sort of like a toddler that's been dropped on its head. Slightly confused, a bit slower than usual and unable to operate heavy machinery. Such as a microwave. At this stage you're still capable of being around people without looking too suspicious, but an occasional paranoid thought of pigeon spying for ISIS makes you consider retreating to a more comfortable setting. Level 2. The narrator. The giant prehistoric looking bird. Things are really starting to ramp up here. The air is slowly turning into maple syrup and you're becoming increasingly aware of your movements through space-time. Probably the best part about this stage is that you turn into your own little David Attenborough and start narrating every one of your actions. Alright man, you got this. Open the freezer, take out the pizza, close the freezer, and put the pizza in the oven. Simple. Level 3. Superhero. At level 3, some really weird shit is starting to happen. If you find yourself in a stationary position, you gain an ability to merge with your surroundings on a molecular level. Your short-term memory and ability to retain information is reduced to that of a mentally challenged puffer fish, and you're semi-confident that your housemate is involved in a conspiracy to overthrow the currently reigning Squirrel King. Once I have even gained an ability to involuntarily glitch through people as I was walking down a street. So... 10 out of 10, best level ever. Level 4. Departure. Here we go! Level 4 is more of a pre-blackout stage. There is a high chance you will end up making out with your porcelain body, but it's alright. Because by this point you've been separated from your cumbersome body and sent to milk leprechauns on the fields of Tatooine. What? The only good part about this level is any paranoia you used to have about the squirrel monarch has left you. As well as your ability to form sentences. Level 5. Snoop Dogg. You have died and been reincarnated as Snoop Dogg. Anyway, thank you for clicking on my video out of all the others out there. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you in the next one. <laughs>